Hi, I'm Gary Nabola and welcome to Cruising with Classic Cars and Hot Rods as we take you on rally rides on some of the nicest back roads that New England has to offer. We'll take you to those car show events and neighborhood cruise nights where you will see and appreciate the labor of love our car owners undertake. For one of our specialties on the show, come experience some of the rally rides throughout New England. Finally, we'll show you that labor of love and what it takes to restore or build your classic car or hot rod. So ladies and gentlemen, start your engines. Because you're cruising with classic cars and hot rods. Classic Cars and Hot Rods, and we're here at the Cape Cod Mall in Hyannis, Massachusetts. This is their 20th annual car cruise. Uh, it's, a, it's called the Cape Cod Classics Car Club is running the show. Uh, if you take a look, we're, a ton of trophies they're going to be handing out. Wonderful, beautiful cars. So we're here, Cape Cod, Massachusetts, for you at Cruising with Classic Cars and Hot Rods. Thank you. Take a look at this gorgeous blue and white Chevy Chevelle. Absolutely beautiful. So guys, this Cruising with Classic Cars and Hot Rods episode is dedicated to Lou Colombo. Mr. Colombo was an accomplished trumpet professional and a Cape Cod native. His life was tragically uh, cut short from a major car crash. He will be greatly, greatly missed. He had uh, a wonderful following here on Cape Cod playing at various uh, cafes and um, restaurants and the like. So. Uh, Keeping, keeping Lou Colombo in mind, we're going to be playing some of his music throughout the show. Thank you. Here's a true classic. Take a look at this beautiful VW Bug uh, here on Cape Cod. Beautiful. Then there was a section for some modern muscle. Uh, some retro classic looks of the brand new uh, Shelby Cobra design and Shelby Mustangs. Uh, very, very cool. There was a Roush 
Uh, just awesome cars. Look at this green GT350 Shelby convertible. Uh, very, very nice. The gentleman was mentioned that years ago he had uh, one of these cars, but he had to sell it uh, because he needed money to buy a tow truck for his business. Well, now he's able to get back his love of his car. The Shelby 1968, I believe, Cobra. This is this is awesome. Is this your your car? Yes, it is. This is gorgeous. Thank you. Beautiful, huh? This is it 50, fifty five? Fifty mm. five. Awesome. Now, what what would be the difference between, say, the way the exhaust is here and the way the exhaust is out there? Is oh, that? What what redesigned the back of the car completely? They made that car's a little bit longer, and they made the exhaust come out through the bumpers. Because of the Continental kit, yeah, they couldn't put it coming out through the back of the car. Enjoy, enjoy the car. It's beautiful. Thank you. Take a look at these Thunderbirds, just awesome. Uh, looked like just uh, coming out right out of the uh, Henry Ford uh, showroom floor, just beautiful. So we're underway on the show. Everybody looks like they're walking around and taking a look at these beautiful cars here at uh, the Cape Cod Mall, and uh, we'll be doing the same. Where are we guys? Say it nice and loud. Awesome. Cape Cod Mall, 20th annual car. Thanks guys. Now there is a nice rendition of the Ford Falcon, which was the uh, predecessor to the Mustang. Take a look at this blue convertible Corsa. Unbelievable. Uh, I haven't seen one of these uh, in a long, long time, uh, and especially not in this condition. Now check out this Camaro. This Camaro by far was one of the cleanest, uh, most coolest uh, Camaros I've seen uh, thus far. Uh, this RS was uh, blue with black stripes, uh, kind of a little bit of a uh, modern twist to it, uh, little Fuchs uh, wheels and uh, underneath had tremendous uh, suspension upgrades and it just amazing car. cool thing they had at this show was uh, quite a bit of classic pickup trucks. Uh, the, the classic pickup trucks that we saw there were just beautiful. The, uh, this one here was a Chevy, I believe, 
but the um, up and coming is an awesome, awesome Ford. Um, just a Ford F100 vehicle. I mean, look at that. That car is just dynamite. I gotta say, the, uh, the Cruising with Classic Cars and Hot Rod film crew was uh, very lucky to see Alex Oliveira uh, doing his work. He's a, uh, for about 45 years now, he was a uh, custom painter, line maker for vehicles, and uh, we're gonna take a look at his art. So let's take a look at uh, Alex's work here. Take a look how steady he, he is. He uses uh, his own technique for his steady hand as he's putting the uh, M on the back of the vehicle with his hand painted talents. Just awesome. Some awesome. books. I did the Franklin. I just put spider webs on the forty-eight. Uh, oh no, Ford. kidding! Yeah. Now, do do you, you clear it afterwards, or no, how's that this work? This is uh, this is a uh, uh, specially uh, designed paint for outdoors. Okay. It's a uh, uh, side painter, pinstriping uh, uh, paint, high pigment. It's awesome. So, <laughs> how long have you been doing it? Uh, about forty-five years. <laughs> well, I won't. I won't keep you. No, not a problem. Not a problem. No, I'm happy to tell people about it. You know. Well, maybe I'll come by and uh, see if you have any cards or anything. I do have cards over there. Yeah. All right, great. Thank you, sir. Yes, thank you. Good to see you. You too. Yeah, I want to see the first product. Uh, I'm So I asked this guy if Alex is going to be around to do any more work. Oh, okay. Out of Plymouth, yeah, he comes down here. He's out around the here working somewhere. He's doing that red Mustang. I think he's doing the red Mustang it, over there. Oh, is yeah. that right? Yeah. Because he was just doing an oval over there. I was yeah, just, yeah. I'm going to take a look. Thank you. Here's uh, Alex working away, has his own stand, everything. He's got a little uh, uh, holder for his 7-Up. He's concentrating. Just pretty cool watching this guy work. Nice job. I know, beautiful. It looks nice. like move, like He's motion, so talented. Like movement, you know? Yeah. It's beautiful. I've still it? got gray hair. So guys, take a look at this car. I didn't know what this car was. This is a Franklin. And uh, just take a look at inside. I mean, just gorgeous wood. Uh, nice leather all over the place. It almost reminds me of a Duesenberg, but uh, it's a Franklin, 
and uh, I believe Alex actually pinstriped this car as well. Take a look at that hood orange. Just a classy, classy car. So guys, this Franklin was an early American automobile uh, from 1902 to 1934. The uh, Franklin Automobile Company was out of Syracuse, New York, and the body was made by a guy named Walker. It was one of the last uh, bodies built in Ansbury. So this car has a uh, pretty, pretty decent and interesting history. So guys, here we are at the Cape Cod Mall, the 20th anniversary car, uh, car show. And what's actually pretty cool is they have a sound meter and the loudest motor wins. How cool is that? Uh, that rat rod is uh, doing some pretty good competition right there. Hey, what guys? Take a look at this rat rod, the artwork, the hidden detail. Pretty impressive. Ladies and gentlemen, a little special uh, tribute to Lou Colombo.
Okay, guys, the show is coming to a close. I want to uh, dedicate this show to uh, Lou Colombo, which is a uh, wonderful, wonderful jazz uh, trumpeteer. And I hope you enjoy the show here at Cape Cod, Hyannis, uh, Massachusetts. Nice. And a thank you to. Uh... Hey, thanks for coming. Awesome job on your on your Mustang. I had a I had a '66 Mustang that I uh, ended up selling to uh, down south. I was in the auto body business and I needed a tow truck. Yeah. So you know what I sold to get the tow truck? 
Yeah. This is nice. Good luck with it. Thank you. Nice car. For any of the uh, kids watching the show, that is Hudson Hornet. Doc Hudson right there. Awesome, awesome. You don't see too many uh, Hudsons around. Here we are, guys, at the Cape Cod Mall in Hyannis, the 20th annual car cruise. Very, very nice. Take care. Thanks for coming. Take care, thanks for coming. Nice car, you don't see too many of these around. Thank you. I tell you, there was a lot of beautiful, beautiful cars here, but I must say, I think this uh, Camaro Z28 was uh, one of my favorites. Thank you for watching Cruising with Classic Cars and Hot Rods, Cape Cod style, here at Hyannis. Thank you. So guys, this is Cruising with Classic Cars and Hot Rods with Gary Nimbola. I want to thank you. Um, anyone wishing to participate in the show, you may email cruisingclassiccars at gmail.com. That's cruisingclassiccars at gmail.com. And for more information, you can visit the events page at www.nevoav.vpweb.com. Thank you, and I uh, hope to see you again.